you bid? I mean, seriously, come on, it's the mall, not Perkins. Old school Joe right here on this glorious Thursday. Is it Thursday? It is Thursday. Glorious Thursday morning. Woke up again with no creamer. I hate that. Now it is official. Ah, oh, November 21st. That is the demolition date for Perkins. So I still gotta yell at you for another uh, 15, 16 days. That's okay. I can do that, whoa. That dude is singing. Not me this time. <laughs> Hey, at least I'm not the only one. Oh yeah, save a lot. Zach Morris will be around soon. Grab your books just to get to the corner to see the bus fly by. It's all right because I'm saved by the bell. I will miss you. I didn't mean to yell at you all these months and tell you to go away. I will miss you. But I will eat those tacos. If I didn't document that, I would be like, oh, I missed the chance. Oh my. That means I gotta make a point to come down and see the wrecking ball on the 21st of November. Oh, wow. One thing I would love to document was before this and before the grocery store stood here. Rumor is, and I don't know the facts or the history, but a dog and suds once stood here. And I have a cup in my garage from dog and suds. Uh, I'm not sure if Dog and Sud stood here or not, but I would love for somebody, if they have them, to send me pics of the old Dog and Suds in Titusville. So if you think about it, this area right here has really has changed and is going to change again. I mean, Central Towers over there was built here in the 70s. I got wind of the old Dog and Sud being here at this location, but I ain't really sure. I don't got no facts, no pictures to run on, nothing I can find, no info on what was here before. And I would love to document it though. If you never heard of the Dog and Suds restaurants, they were the old pull up and they bring your food to you, stick it right in your window. 50s restaurants that, you know, girls on skates, not rollerblades, no, not rollerblades. But I love the change. And that, on East Main. Yeah, on East Main. They got rid of the old funeral home there too. If I could totally go back in time, oh, and do a daily like 20, 30, 40 years ago, I think it would be so awesome to document what was here and what's gone and what's coming in. Documenting is my favorite, but did you know I just caught the mall countdown? I was on my phone and I seen they extended it one more day and I thought, whoa, so I caught it on camera. Now it's like, hopefully whoever bought it takes care of it and keeps it the mall. I'm just saying, but I love documenting stuff and I figured I'd go around today, document what's around Perkins, 
because in less than 20 days it's going to be gone like i said i wish i did this 40 years ago and documented changes and progression and stuff i just find it cool um not that things are disappearing that i love like i would love to know if dog and suds actually existed there but i, I figured i would go document it for somebody who watches this video 10 years from now they're gonna say oh so that's what was there before taco bell yes you're welcome <laughs> i'll let you go today oh man what a busy day but I'll see you tomorrow, like normal, like clockwork. Check out my social media. Check out my uh, merchandise store. Almost forgot what I was going to say. Down below is all my merchandise. New designs coming. Hopefully you have a good rest of your day. I'll see you tomorrow, Friday. Friday already. Oh, man.